Hello and welcome back everybody to Graveyard Keeper and today we are going to continue on uh, I'm gonna start putting some food items in here so but yeah welcome back to Graveyard Keeper and it's the middle of the night we are gonna do what we can do and I think I'm going to start stocking up on some logs and stuff of that nature but first we're gonna come in here we're gonna to talk to Jerry we're gonna give him his beer what a disappointment I think I need something stronger alright you seem like a decent guy so here's some advice stop running around bragging that you're from another world today you whisper that to a drinking buddy at a tavern and tomorrow your face is on every pole in the town so if you just want to keep yours just stop okay maybe he's right I should be more careful so what was your question? Uh, let's see. I have some questions. Uh, how can I get home? You could use the portal on which hill? Do I need to turn it on first? I obviously don't have a brain inside here. <laughs> I've told you everything I can remember. Maybe some books from the library can help you while the church has a library in its cellar. Or maybe astrologer knows something. He's a smart man. He used to steal books from libraries. How can I get to the library? Obviously through the church. I think your wine cellar might be connected to the church. All the underground stuff in this game all seems to be connected. Uh, even the morgue is connected. The network tunnels down here. I used to like fishing. I remember fishing. I always caught a fish. The sard. I have no hands to show how big it was. Blah, blah, blah. I hate fish tails. And once, you know what? I need to go. Sure, sure forget to bring me some wine okay uh, every moon day where's the lighthouse he doesn't remember and we'll go back leave okay I'll see you later and we will go and work a bit more on the graveyard We'll get a bunch of these sticks out of here, and that'll give us more wooden sticks. I don't think we have any gravestones, no. We will work on that. Minus 13. That's, for the moment, about all we can do. But let's go and see, we need We need stone. We'll start collecting that up. And we'll need trees as well. But we'll get that from <clears throat> closer to our home. And this is a place down here I'm going to need to get rolling fairly soon and down here when you research it you can build funeral pyres because down here is the crematorium where you can cremate bodies that aren't good enough to wind up going into your uh, graveyard and you get some different materials for that too See if we can't train some of these up. And 
and we will we'll, let's let's see if, can we get this tree no if that one's locked how about this one yes we can get this one so let's get that tree cut down and while we're here we'll grab these mushrooms and we'll get this stump up let's grab these mushrooms here can we get the mushrooms apparently not alright let's take a look at our technologies see can we do we can do anatomy uh, simple gravestones let's get that unlocked and that um, that gives us everything we can do for the time being Let's see. Let's go in here and see what we can build. If we can build anything yet. Uh, let's see. Wooden anvil. Okay, how do we get those? Sawhorse. Alright, let's get the sawhorse built and placed. I forget that there's a lot of like researching and stuff like that. Okay, let's get wooden billet, a set of wooden billets, and a set of flitch. Let's get that. All right. Now let's see. Okay, can't add a trunk, can't add a furnace. We can get a wooden anvil. Uh, timber stockpile we've already got. Increase yard space. We can't do anything there yet. Uh, let's get the wooden anvil. And uh, let's put that right there. All right. Can we craft anything here yet? No, we can't because we don't have any iron. Okay. A wooden marker we need nails so we can't do that all right let's just get some more flitch crafted let's see if there is anything else we can build we can't because we don't have metal we can get more stone that's not a big deal so we still need to get the furnace Okay, we still need to get the furnace. Okay. That we can do next. But now we can start manipulating some firewood. So now, what would be a good thing to do? Okay, we can drop off stone. We can drop off all that stuff. We have a wet stone, we have a teleportation stone. Okay, um, yeah. Let's see where we can teleport to. Uh, teleport to the dead horse. This is the tavern. See if we can do anything here. Trade. Uh, wine. We can't do anything with wine yet. Um, yeah, all right. talk with my husband he's in charge here all right we can't do anything else there so all right let's get out of here and see if there is anything we can do I think over here we can get some cabbages 
cabbage seeds. That gives us enough to plant one set of cabbages when we get to that point. Um, we can sell some stuff. Uh, we do have cabbages. Let's see. Can we do anything here? Actually, I'm new here. Another world. Need to go back. Oh, thank God. Mine's world. Blah, blah, blah. Not highborn. Let's see what he has for trade. Um, we can get gold jewelry details for 50 silver. <clears throat> grape seeds, royal fish, grape seeds, and silk. Cannot sell him anything yet. So, oh, here. This is one thing we can do. We cannot do. Technologies, let's see. Farming and nature cannot do anything with as of yet. Alright. Cremation. Okay, this won't be too far away. But still a bit blah blah. blah. Can't do nothing there. Glass, uh, anvil, tools. I'm not too far from that. Uh, firewood. That should be the next thing we unlock. Firewood. Because we can sell uh, firewood to a lot of the people. Since we can't get the berries yet. Alright, I'm going to talk to him. Trade, can we trade anything to you? Uh, no. We can buy the stuff, but that is really expensive. We're not going to go that route. So let's just see. Uh, can Do we have enough to buy eggs? Fresh eggs. Okay. Trade. We can buy three. Not worth it. Okay, come on. We can get, we can gather some mushrooms. can't gather mushrooms can't gather berries so pretty much pretty much can't do anything I don't think we can gather honey either can we can. We got stung a bit. That's fine. We will just wander our way home and sleep for the night. But there's not much of anything we can do. We just have to basically continue doing what we have been doing. Oh. Okay, so now we can gather. Alright, and we can create that stuff. Hmm. 
do I look like a magic head with answers? Well, huh, exactly what I said. Well, technically, yeah. Now, we can gather berries and stuff. And to start with, I'm going to drag the berries. Can you... Uh, well, you can eat the cabbage, I imagine. All right, and we're starting to gather some nature skill points. And we will come in here and we will go to sleep. Uh, can we do anything else? In here. Uh, we can't do baked meat. We can make omelets. We can make fried eggs. Fuel. Okay, we can't do anything there yet. Um, I'll put the cabbage in there. I'll put the mushrooms and the honey. Uh, we could have used the energy potion, but I'm not going to. All right, let's sleep and save. That'll heal us back up. That will save the game. It will restore our energy. And tomorrow we will go back out and do a bit of gal gathering after we deal with this. This is not good, not good at all. Who do you think you are? I'm the graveyard keeper. Hooray, a kipper. Wow, I've been here for I don't know how long. Poor, poor me. Waiting on contrary. Glad to see you. Rather unpleasant fellow buried here. We'd really like to have a new neighbor instead. <clears throat> Sounds like something you can help us with. Not exactly sure. Jared only told me about burying baddies, uh, that half-dead skull, blah, 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 only dream of a peaceful rest. Who am I kidding? It's terrible here, especially that guy in the lower right corner grave. He's so mean. Could you just get rid of him? Just dig him up and throw him in the river. I can even give you this license that I stole back when I was alive. It's an exhumation license, or exhumation permission to dig up the corpses. And yes, there are some corpses in the graveyard that you will need to uh, dig up. Because some of them that are buried there are absolutely gross. That's mysterious man. Darn gate. Come here every night if I have to. The path is blocked. You need a bunch of stuff that we can't do yet. So, but here, we can get some nails and other stuff that will help us get some basic stuff uh, started. And flour. and more flour I don't understand why I'm so laggy all of a sudden I should not be laggy Okay, now, can we get firewood? Okay, let's get firewood. That will allow us to create a chopping spot. <clears throat> Alright, we can do that. <clears throat> we can build another trunk. But we have a trunk here. Recipe. <clears throat> nice. 
Let's use that. Baked mushrooms, baked apples. Nice. That is what I wanted. So, we don't have enough. We have to gather more mushrooms. <coughs> but for the time being, we will do that. And stuff that we are going to use later. Oh, no, 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 no. Wake up. I wanted to put in here. All right. Now, we can come out here. Let us see if we can build the, what was it, chopping spot. We need some more billets, so that's fine. We'll just go and get us a tree that we can cut down somewhere. Maybe we can get one of these. All right. All right, come on. some more billets and chopping spot All right, I'm gonna put that there just for no other reason than I can and now we can take and turn uh, billets into firewood and we can recycle some of the other stuff so, but I'm going to do that. I'm going to make a set of firewood. Because we can use that for our furnace. And we can also sell firewood to start making a little bit of coinage. And coinage in this game, yeah, is very... Uh, slow to come by. I'm going to put the rest of the wood in there. I'm going to put that and that in there. Uh, let's see. Furnace, we just need some more stone. So we can go, we'll go and we'll harvest up some stone and then we'll get that. All right. There should be some stone right around here that we can get fairly easily. Technically, we just need one piece, but I'm going to get a couple of pieces because resources in this game, you use a stupidly crazy amount of resources. Stone and wood in particular. And I'm going to save that. I'm going to get the furnace up. We'll get the furnace up. We'll put the furnace. Let's put the furnace right there. And yep, I think I have to build it. All right. Now, uh, fuel from firewood, fuel from sticks. We can't do much of anything, but we can smelt iron there. That is basically, that puts us well on our way to uh, being able to deal with iron. So what we're going to do now is once we stop lagging again, give me just a second. I'm going to hop into 
the options here and see if there is a graphical option that we can turn down and there is not anything pretty much that we can fiddle with so let's continue we'll go over and we'll take care of the um, we'll try to dig up the bad dude but we're gonna grab these mushrooms first and first off and the first part of the game is pretty much going to be our staple one of our staple food sources mushrooms and the berries we can eat them as they are but they provide much better benefit when they are cooked so I'm gonna come down and bottom right corner is this guy okay that guy is actually fairly good that guy's fairly good that guy's fairly good I believe you can do this with anybody we can exhume him Grab the body and let us take it to the morgue and get what we can get out of it because it's we're basically only going to throw it in the river anyway so as I like to say waste not want not we'll throw him in here and first let's see if we can So I don't know we don't have enough to get all of it so let's get these first so we extract that don't forget that we'll get that out first get that out then we'll just go and chuck him in the river all right and after we do that we will head to bed I believe we can go here anywhere Maybe not. Maybe there's a certain spot. Maybe they changed it. Maybe it does matter which one you take. Ah, there we go. I guess it still doesn't matter. Jerry will appear momentarily. I do remember that from the last time I played. Ah, yep. Ghost asked me to get rid of the body. 
bite you to death. Huh. Do you know that? How can I burn a body? We need fire and wood. Okay. It's a bit tricky. You need to make. That's where you get ash and salt. And you do also get burial certificates for that, so. And he tells you basically what I said earlier about the place for the crematorium. You gotta go through this, I think. Okay. And this will tell you some things. Reach five at the graveyard. We can't do anything about that just yet. But that is something that we can start working on. So. Ah. <clears throat> uh. The Inquisitor. <clears throat> I don't really want to uh, get into it with the Inquisitor today. I don't have a lot of energy. But let's get that, get it over with. Come up here and see. No, oh, no, can't harvest anything else. And this is the cutscene. Strange fella snooping around. Oh, there he is. Guys, calm down. I live here at the graveyard. He calls us guys. Well, he's a cultist for certain. I'm the graveyard keeper. Alright. This guy, Monsignor here, all he is worried about is burning witches. Yeah, so I'm going to speed past this part as quickly as I can. As one of the least favorite parts. The dark cults rising, it's only the beginning, blah blah blah. Blah, blah, blah. Come on. All right. So you work with a lot of dead bodies, huh? Yes, I think it's part of my job. You live right beside the hill near the graveyard. Yes, interesting. Be my friend. Friend of the Inquisition. Okay, I agree to be his friend. Whatever. Sure, it'll be a pleasure. A couple minor tasks for you. We can talk any that day. Uh, can I leave? Can I talk to you? Talk, not now. Okay. Alright, so now we are pretty much free to go on about our business. And if I sleep now, it's going to be in the middle of the day, and we'll wake up in the middle of the night, but there's not much for it. We're just going to have to uh, do what we can basically I believe if you go this way I think you can get back to your house no you've got to clear this giant mess and yeah it's a giant mess it's not too bad what is that that looks different
Did I find anything? Skill points. Not much else. And I don't have any uh, energy for anything else. This place here, eventually, you can grow grapes here. But that is one of, but one of the only things I remember. Um, yep. So we are gonna go, go sleep. See if can we grab that flower. I think that's about the only thing we have energy to do. So we will go and this area right here that I'm standing in right now uh, is where we're going to be able to do some farming, grow our own vegetables and stuff. And I do believe that eventually we can find and create zombies to do a lot of work for us for a lot of things. So I'm going to stop here. I'm going to throw that in there, throw that in there. Um, whoop. I'll throw flowers in there for now. We'll throw that in there, we'll throw that in there. All right. And we will set up this. I don't think we have enough to do it, no. Um, we can set up a baked mushroom. That's fine. That'll help us out some. And we'll go to sleep. So hopefully, if you like this episode, guys, and if you like the series so far and the game, I will see you in the next episode. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave them down in the description, or yeah, in the comment section below. I do that every time. But until then, I will see you later. Bye-bye.